welcome back to Zerg's Inc. Says, uh, this is episode 21, I think. I'm still, I'm still, still, still doing it like this, but the more you do it, the better you get. When I've made 10,000 hours worth of content, I will be a YouTube master. That's how the saying goes. That's how, it's not a saying, it's, this, it's how fucking statistical, hard research and evidence. Fucking car. Statistics and evidence has shown that ten, putting 10,000 hours into something basically makes you an expert at it. So when I've made 10,000 hours worth of Zerxank says, you can guarantee by that point I'll be an expert. At this point, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, like, well, like, yeah, oh yeah, I suck, but uh, so you suck on your mum's clit, so, uh, so, when, yeah, so, it's like, and she likes it, so, so everyone wins, you know? I'm not into MILF, really, like, older, older women and stuff, because they're old. You know, it's not because they're women, but it's just it's because they're old, and only if they're old. Like, so someone can be a mother and like not be old. Did you know that? If you didn't, you do now. You don't have to be old to be a mother, but you do have to be a woman. Let me let me hammer back down on that point of a. Uh, trans thing, that's, a, that's another kind of a defining factor, like being able to have a kid. I think through some surgeries, someone at some point was able to have a kid, but oh wait, no, that was someone who was she was born female, had a sex change, and then uh, gender reassignment, sorry. Uh, I don't care, fuck you. Um, the person had a gender reassignment they didn't but um they think she she thinks she thinks she had a gender reassignment to male she didn't but then she got pregnant which basically proves that she's not a fucking it proves that you know, you're like you can't be a male and pregnant and be like well i i still believe that i'm male no you need to get psychological help and there are there are there's treatment for it you there's actual hormonal treatment you know it helps with the psychological stress of being yeah because I, I understand it it's it's nothing to do with people just being like i choose to be this because that's what i feel like no it's it, it is actually in the mind they do people do actually mislabel themselves because that's the way that they are thinking you know but it isn't healthy and statistics and evidence shows that most of those people are depressed those people are depressed and they kill themselves you know so they do need help whether you agree or not statistics back my point up so if you get statistics to disprove me then we get to both be right wouldn't that be great a world where everybody wins 